Welcome back to Gardner's Orchard. In this week's farm update, we talked to you about where we're going to be at this weekend. If you've ever heard of Saturdays, we'll be there this weekend with our baked goods. We'll also be talking to you about what we do in this high tunnel. If you've ever been on the farm, you've seen this over here. Uh, we've grown a lot of tomatoes in here this year. Plus, our farm tours are ready. Uh, but before we go check out what's going on with the farm tours, let's go see what Farmer Dre's doing in here. Um, he's uh, getting ready to move some crops from a summer to a fall crop. Let's go check it out and see what he's doing. So we're in here in the high tunnel. Kind of looks like a jungle right now. Uh, but Farmer Dre's over here, so let's see what he's doing and what's going on in here. So as Radu said, this looks like a jungle here, but it's been a good year for tomatoes. So this year we planted the big beefs, Red Dews, Carolina Gold, Celebrities. It's been a good run. We picked over 4,000 pounds of tomatoes out of here. And after today, we're picking the last of our good tomatoes. We're going to go ahead and strip it out and get ready, get ready for the winter. Maybe plant some kale or spinach for the fall and then through the winter because those crops don't need any kind of supplemental heat. So it makes it easy for us to grow in the high tunnel here. So now, let's go ahead and check in with Red Dew. So we're out here in our orchard with our farm trailer that we got it finished just for our hay rides, for our farm tours that we do here on the farm. We finally got this trailer ready. We were waiting for it for a few weeks. Everything's put together now. Everything is ready to go. We, start the, we started those farm tours last week. We got school groups already coming. We got larger groups that already have their reservations made. You can make those reservations for yourself and your family as well. You can do that online at GardenersOrchardAndBakery.com under our Farm Tours tab. You can also make the reservations by calling in if you have a group of 10 or more. There's special discounts for that. If you are an educational or church group or some kind of event that you guys are planning with any kind of group, give us a call. We have special pricing for groups of 10 or more. Uh, this trailer here was made specifically for what we do here on the farm. So we'll be going through our high tunnel. We'll show you exactly what we do in there, what we grow, uh, the different crops, the winter crops, summer crops. We go through our facility. We show you how we have cold storage, where we keep um, all of our produce throughout the year, how we wash our apples. We'll come through with the trailer um, into the orchard. You get to pick some apples and we'll go ahead and process that through our washer. You see how it's sorted and then you get to pick it and then enjoy the apple that's part of that same trailer. We also have where you can pre-order a baked good or a drink that comes along with um, your farm tour, but that has to be called in. That's usually available for larger groups. Uh, come out and see us. It's so much fun. Um, here's a few pictures and some montages of what we did last week with the group that came through. As you saw, we grow all kinds of stuff in the high tunnel there with Farmer Dre. This is actually one of his new projects here on the farm. It's a high density orchard system that we have. Um, it's a, a trellis system where it allows the trees to support themselves on the wire. But we'll do another update on that next week. Um, like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, we actually are going to be at Cider Days this weekend. We're going to have uh, mini four inch pies with a variety of different flavors. We're doing caramel apples um, that with apples right here from our orchard. Uh, come see us, we're gonna be there Saturday and Sunday. Um, we still have you pick available right here on the farm. Uh, we're doing Jonathan's and Grimes Golden again this week. We also have some other ones, but uh, we will announce those on our Facebook page um, and on our website um, this week. We'll see which ones are ready. Um, come out and see us on Saturdays. Thank you once again for all your support. Um, and until next time, I would say let's have an apple a day, but I don't have an apple, so we'll see you next week.
So I'm out here with our cows. I said I don't have an apple, but look, you can still have an apple today because even our cows love our apples. 